Thanks for that, Neve. Uh, just a quick word on Santiago Solari, whose audition for the Real Madrid job is going rather well, Brian. That's three wins from three. Steady the ship there. Yeah, well, look, you know, he's in a bit of a mess and uh, important enough that they won the game tonight. Left out some of the main players. Isco and Modric didn't play. A lot of new faces in the back line probably felt they could get away with it. And now they're in comfortable enough position. They'll just want to get through the group. Remembering last year, that in the group, mm. they, they played second fiddle to Spurs and yet they won the competition. And I always think if they get through to Christmas in they reasonable it, nick, they? they know what to do when it comes to the second half of the league. And also a quick mention about your old pal Thierry Henry who's having oh. a horrible old time uh, in football management. That's uh, five games without a win, a 4-0 home defeat in the Is Champions League. Is that four three. losses, one draw? Yeah. Tough stuff. You know, no one said that management business was easy. <laughs> You know, I mean, did you see earlier that you had two 18-year-olds and two 19-year-olds on I the think pitch at the two, end? Two 17-year-olds and two 19-year-olds. Has he been on the phone night. looking for advice? <laughs> no, I'll pass him on to you if he doesn't. Well, do you know call. who has been linked to the job if he does get the sack? His old manager, Arsene Wenger. Mm. It's true, according to the papers. Final thought on Manchester United, Graham. City at the weekend. Is there a tactic? Go behind, and then. Yeah, listen. It's, it's um, great result from tonight. They got away with it, didn't deserve it really. Yeah. Um, but you'll take it. And Sunday is a very different game for them. Probably can't afford to go behind uh, against mm. City.